I got it. It's on. Oh man, oh man, oh man. So exciting, guys. You'll just have to go check it out for yourself. Good morning, people of the internet. It's like real foggy. Like, can't even see anything. Holy moly. It actually kind of looks like smoke. But the sun's still so bright you can't look up. It's crazy. And Levi keeps trying to eat the kids' food that they throw on the floor. Because he's a bad boy, right Levi? Say, I'm a bad boy. I'm a bad boy. Yeah, he doesn't care. Ariana's making crepes for breakfast and they're delicious. Oh, and Apple announces iPhone 6 today. Woo -woo! What are you doing with Ariana's flip flops? Is it? Is it? Yeah, she's, she's wearing them and jumping in them. <laughs> oh, yeah, Micah, go. <laughs> Countdown continues. There's currently 14 minutes and almost 35 seconds left until the Apple event begins. Letting you guys know that probably every vlog this week will have some kind of music montage in it just because a lot of footage is really interesting to see, but there's no words. Yeah, not so it's more boring to watch it without the music. So, probably every video you'll end up with a music montage. So, now we need to go buy more music. And so we, she's almost got this finished up, yeah, I think we're gonna be done. which will go live at, of course, 3.30 p.m. Central Standard Time after the Apple event is over. I'm so excited. iPhone 6 is going to be announced. So the Apple event just started like a few minutes ago, and it won't load for me at all. And I got to go get some heat on. Okay, you do that. And Brian Lanning tweeted a picture and said that he couldn't get it either, so I know it's not just me, and we're just gonna go outside now. So, needless to say, I am not happy about that because I was so excited to watch it, but I guess like everybody else is outside, and I guess it's just God or the world telling me I need to go outside and spend time with my family, not sit inside cooped up to watch the Apple event. But I am sad. I was so excited. But when we get back in, I will read everything. Like literally the entire website about everything that's new. So it'll be okay. I got it. It's up. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. So exciting, guys. You'll just have to go check it out for yourself. Try to change, get the trunks on, because we're going swimming. Walking in a straight line, that's not really her style And they all got the same heartbeat, but hers is falling behind Nothing in this world could ever bring them down Yeah, they're invincible, and she's just in the background she says, I wish that I could be like the cool kids Cause all the cool kids, they seem to fit in I wish that I could be like the cool kids Like the cool kids Mitch 
just saw. It's like a dead fish. Cookies. And it's huge. Well, not huge, but it's big. I could be like the cool kids. Like the cool kids. I wish that I could be like the cool kids Cause all the cool kids, they seem to fit in I wish that I could be like the cool kids Like the cool kids Hello, I'm cooking dinner tonight We are burgers. cooking dinner tonight Well, yes And we're having turkey burgers Sweet potato fries mm -hmm. and some green beans. Yeah. Want to get around to it? And they're playing uh, Settlers of Catan. I won the last game. You know me. Oh. I wish that I could be like the cool kids Cause all the cool kids, they seem to fit in I wish that I could be like the cool kids Like the cool kids Levi is trying to get food. Dad, do you see him? You just can't wait till we have a child now so you can clean up everything, huh? <laughs> Come on. Come on. <laughs> We're going to end the vlog today, guys. We I don't know how much footage we got today. We might not have a ton. But because we don't have a ton, I thought we'd show you this. So, Katie... Our sister-in-law um, made this for us, and it has Revelyn's name. It says Orion and Ariana production of 2014. And so she made this, and it's really cute. Um, Katie actually has an Etsy shop, which I will link in the bottom bar. It's her shop's on vacation right now because we're on vacation. But you can follow her shop, and then when she's not on vacation, you can go look at her stuff. Um, but she has a lot of really cute, like, baby onesies and stuff. So definitely check her out. So yesterday's question was, if you could only have two of the five senses, what would you choose? Mine would have to be sight and touch. That's exactly what I was going to say. Because I feel like if you didn't have touch, then it's like you have no feeling, obviously. Mm -hmm. But it's like you're basically paralyzed without being paralyzed. I think I think it would be absolutely terrible. Sight for me definitely. Hearing I think I could easily learn sign language, so that one's not as big. And you could still read. Yeah, and write. you can still read and you can still write to people and stuff. Um, but definitely touch was the other one I was gonna say because also one of my love languages is physical touch. So if I couldn't feel a hug, That'd that would be, be terrible. That'd be, be really so strange. So yeah, that's mine. So since we have been playing a lot of games this vacation, we are going to ask you guys, what's your favorite game? Like board game, card game, whatever your like favorite game to play is with others, obviously. If you give me an iPhone game, I'm going to be a little upset. Not going to lie. <laughs> I really hope that an iPhone game is not your favorite. So like a game that you're forced to interact with other people. And not like online games. Real people in real, real life. <laughs> like you're sitting next to somebody playing a game. Mm -hmm. Make sure you give the thumbs up. And we'll see you guys tomorrow as always. Bye, Bye. guys.